This is a dishwasher that I just purchased for my uh, rental property here. It's a Frigidaire dishwasher and uh, it's quite reliable, it's not expensive and uh, it's very very valuable. Okay, if you buy something like that, remember that's not gouache, but the price you get it is really worth it. So I'm going to open it. Okay, and what you see here, all kind of stuff inside. Already opened it before, so what I want to show here, there is a manual how to install everything here. So I just want to show you how I'm going to install the electrical cable to this uh, dishwasher. It's very simple and I just want you to follow it that you don't need to pay to install a hundred to hundred and fifty dollars for it. So to install the electricity, the electrical cable, what you need to do, you need to flip this dishwasher on its back. So I'll show you how I'm flipping it. That's it. And now what I have to do, I have to remove this panel here, the black panel, in order to get access to the electrical box. So to remove this black panel, what I have to do, I have to remove the screw here. It's one screw, second screw, I hope it's going to actually go very easily. Maybe. We open the panel and you see this is the electrical box here. What we need to do, we need to open the box. It's very important, we need to open the box first. To open the box, there is a screw here, which is really tricky to take it out. If I can, but I need a special screw to remove it. So unfortunately, you have to use um, you have to use a special a bead, okay, with a star head, okay. And I just want to try to see if we can, if we can open it. As you can see, it's been opened. And the screw is here, as you can see it here. And over here, and the box. This is the box. And what you see here, you see here. These wires, okay, and let me show you from close proximity what you have here. Okay, so the box was here, really, okay. So is the cable coming from here is no problem, you see. You see the ca this, this wire coming from here. We're going to put our cable here, and we used to use a special conduit. We have to put our cable here, that it will go here. It will connect with these two wires, and with the ground is here. And we just, I just want to see if three quarters of an inch conduit is it's okay here, or I need to have a half an inch. It took to me like a three quarter of an inch. So here, three quarter of an inch conduit is in my hand here, and I try to push it. As you can see, it cannot go in. Okay, so that's probably half an inch or five feet. So I'm going to actually purchase a conduit for this uh, dishwasher, and I want to show you. I want to show you how to install it. Okay, so this is the cable I purchased, and what I want to do now, I just want to remove the installation here, uh, removing exactly probably like a one inch from each size, and from here. So you can see here, this is the hot, this is the neutral, and this is the ground, okay? And I actually have here a half an inch, it's actually three eighths of an inch um, conduit, and I just want to show you how I'm going to use it. Okay, so what I'm doing here, you can see this conduit here. So the first thing I'm doing here, um, you see this, this conduit have a place where you can actually pass here you can pass the cable that's what i'm doing i'm actually passing the cable through this conduit okay and it's going here and as you can see i can give it until here i'm just going to close these two screws here that you can see and i'm really going to attach 
this cable that I purchased, it's actually six feet. I purchased from Home Depot, it's a flexible cable. Okay, so. You can see how strong it is, how tight it is. What I'm going to do now, I'm going to actually put it in the hole. There is a hole there, let me show you. Here is the hole, okay? So what I'm doing, I'm actually removing this washer. You see the washer here? That's the conduit. I'm taking the conduit and put it in. So this works, okay? And then I'm taking the washer here, with me here. Okay, and I'm going to just put it, and I'm going to actually tighten it very strong. Because what you really want, you don't want this wire to just get out of it. Okay? So here it is, and I'm going to get, use a plier now to just lock it. So here is the plier that I get, and I'm going to take this plier and I'm really going to tighten it here. That's it. So now it really will never move from here. Okay, I can pull it as much as I want, it's not going to happen. So after we make this, we need to connect now the ground. Remember, the ground is first to be connected. And the ground connected here to this green screw. Okay, so the first wire we're going to connect is the ground here. So this is the ground, and I'm actually going to put as a loop here. Okay, with the clock. Remember? It have to be with the clock. We go in. Okay. And what I'm going to do now, I'm going to close it, lock it. So remember, the ground should be really tight. We don't want any any issue with that. So there is two wire here that coming from let's say from the dishwasher. So you actually have to put them through this hole. You see here, but you see they are too long. So they will be connected the white to the white and the black to the black. That's the black is the hot. So it's too big. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to cut it here. Okay, here. Both of them. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to just try to remove here, kind of, uh, see if it's easy, because nothing easy in this fish portion. Okay, this one, it's okay. And that's it, the second one. Try again. Okay, so you can see here, I remove both of these insulation, the white and the black. Okay, so after I remove the insulation, I'm taking these. These two white, okay, both of them are the neutral, remember? Neutral. I put them here, using these. connector really and I really want to put it strongly here so you have one and now is the hat here same thing you take the hat here put it a little bit here and then same thing connector okay so that's it okay now there is the box remember so the box is here. That's the box. It's going here and it's locked here. Okay, so you can see this one doesn't move really. If I push it here, this cable doesn't move. Nothing move here. Okay, the ground is connected. Okay, we'll check it very soon if the ground is connected properly. This is the screw. Okay, so that's it. So the box is already attached, the cable is attached, and this one already attached. So just to, we make a little bit of testing here now. Uh, after I'm going to connect this plug here, you see I have to connect plug to this one. So I will show you how to do it also. 
So that's the way it looks from close proximity, as you can see, is the cable and the cable under. You can see the way it's actually look. Okay, you can see the conduit here. Okay, and it's connected here. It's the cable. Even if I pull it in my hand, nothing really happens. So this is the plug that I purchased, okay, and I just already connected. Everybody can connect something like that. You can see here, just make sure the right one, this should be the hot. This should be the neutral. The neutral always is the left, okay, and this is the ground here. You see, this is the ground, this is the neutral, and this is the hot. So with the connection here, you can see the black is going to the hot, and the white going to the to the left which is neutral and here is the ground is connected here as you can see to the screw here so as you can see I already just screw these three screws here to attach this cover properly and now what I have I have two here you see this one will attach the plastic to this cable If the ground, which is here, connected to the ground, which is really the body here, okay, the metal, okay, that's your protection here. So I put this, now it's a whole meter, okay, you can see it here, and if I'm actually going to make a short here, you can see what's happening here, it's going to zero, so what I want to see here, I'm going to take it, I'm going to touch it here, okay, and that's it. So I attach it in the metal and you can see it's connected. If I will do that, this is the this is the the heart, it's infinite. So that's good. If it's a neutral, it's also show infinite. Okay, and between the neutral and the ground, it should be infinite also. So that's it. So we tested everything working here. The only thing we have to do is just to close this uh, panel and think it's done.